Hello minions, welcome back. Today we are here to begin our journey on learning solid principles, starting with single responsibility principle. This principle, as the name suggests, states that a class should have only one job or responsibility and the business concerns should be segregated accordingly. Let's go through an example to understand it in a better way. Let's create a user manager class which can authenticate a user as well as store user details. If we take a deeper look, here the user manager class performs two different operations, that is, authenticate and store users. Changes in one operation could lead to a change in the class, thereby affecting the other. We will now separate out the businesses by adopting single responsibility principle. We have now segregated, authenticate and store into two different classes, each dealing with their own responsibility, thereby not affecting the changes in the other. This way, single responsibility principle helps in creating more focused subsets, promotes maintainability, reduce complexity and more focused classes to modify and test. Thanks for watching the video. Hit the like button and subscribe for more content.